Local bridge that just recently reopened after being damaged by the historic floods of 2010 is being renamed in honor of a local historical figure. Eyewitness News reporter Jennifer Mobilia joins us now live in her studio with the details that are new at five. Well, Mike, after being closed for more than two years, the Laurel Avenue Bridge in Coventry is now back open to traffic and it now bears a new name. That musket fire by members of the Rhode Island Historic Militia marked the rededication of the Laurel Avenue Bridge as the Major General Nathaniel Green Bridge. Green was a Revolutionary War hero and a close friend of George Washington. He lived just down the street for several years during the 18th century. The bridge itself had to be rebuilt after sustaining serious damage during the historic floods two and a half years ago. It just reopened to traffic last month and by hiring a single contract contractor to both design and build the new bridge. The DOT says it was able to shave years off of the project's timeline. Getting it back in service is really important to the local community, and I think we're very pleased to be able to deliver that for them. Um, and again, eight weeks ahead of what the construction schedule called for, and months, if not years, faster than a traditional um, bridge replacement project would have taken. So we're very pleased and we're very appreciative of the patience that the community has shown over the two years since the floods of 2010. The bridge is located just off Route 117 in Coventry and carries Laurel Avenue over the Patuxent River. The project costs just under $3 million. I'm Jennifer Mobilia, Eyewitness News.